So some players are doing a prop bet where you play a 17 card fantasy land hand against a regular pineapple hand. And the regular hand gets a handicap. And I've seen it handicap up to 100 points, which if you're getting the 100, just take it. <laughs> uh, I'd, I'd say 50 or 40 is more reasonable as far as what really uh, is expected to happen over a number of hands. So I built this 17 card fantasy land practice module, which you can uh, reset and deal and play as many times as you like. And you can get an indication of how many times you would repeat with the 17 cards with the module. And here's how to get to the module. If you go to the home page and go to the training page, just scroll down, you'll find it in 17 card fantasy land. And uh, we'll go and see how many hands in a row we can hit fantasy land. There's, this is a first hand repeat. Trips in front or quads in back is the qualification. No boat boat. Anytime I see a high set of trips, I'll uh, put it in front and see if I can support it. In this case, I could not. But the trip nines work out. After I figured out how to support them, a couple of straights got the job done. On to the next hand, whereupon a straight flush was dealt. So that's another repeat. So that's three in a row. Straight flush, 15 in the back. Middle flush, 8. And then this is the fourth hand. And the streak stopped here. Got a double flush, a couple of threes. Tried the trip threes in front, didn't work out. So that's where it ends. So three in a row. And then if you'd like to test the uh, regular pineapple hand against this scenario, you can play just, just below on the, on the training page. You can get there, and then you can play the pineapple hand, and then you can see how it works out against the fantasy land hand. I did actually a number of lengthy tests, which I'll get into in another video, on how that scenario plays out and what the real handicap probably is.